This is the new political ad to help officially launch Cranley's gubernatorial campaign. I talked with him one on one. He is laser focused as he takes his message all across the state. Message number one, jobs. That comeback is going to be about jobs that build the infrastructure, high speed broadband Wi-Fi for the whole state, clean water initiatives, fixing our roads and our bridges. And those jobs are good paying jobs. Message number two from the two term Democratic mayor. He will tell voters it's time for a political cleansing in Columbus. Talking about how they've gotten such a raw deal from one party corrupt rule for 32 years that has nickel and dimed them, led to lower wages, literally taking money out of people's pockets to give it to the big utility companies in the HB6 scandal. My ideas are the opposite. Now is a time when we're experiencing, obviously, uh, a health pandemic, and it's starting to go in the wrong direction. Uh, those are the type of challenges that you'll confront that, you know, a couple of years ago you wouldn't have even imagined. Talk a little bit about that. Well, I th we, we've handled it here in Cincinnati, you know. Um, there's no question that being mayor over the last year during COVID uh, and George Floyd were two of the most difficult professional challenges that we, and as a city, we've ever had to go through. But we've come through it. Cranley says he hopes to give a $500 dividend, as he calls it, to every Ohio family, money that will come from energy resources from the state. And he's saying up front, if he wins and if he is not able to fulfill his campaign promises, he won't run again. I'm Curtis Fuller, WLWT News 5.